Hi, I'm Jerry James Stone, and in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to make a delicious and just simply wonderful watermelon and jalapeno shrub paloma. Now, if you hadn't had a paloma before, it's this tasty cocktail, but I'm substituting a shrub from Element Shrub, I'm using this honeydew and jalapeno shrub, in for the grapefruit juice. I tasted this shrub when I was actually judging the Sophie Awards, which is one of the best things that I get to do as a food blogger. Um, the Sophie Awards have been around, I think, forever. It's this really great opportunity for up and coming food makers to showcase their work and to really get exposure. But don't take my word for it. I had this little clip from when I was at the fancy food show in New York with Brittany from the Specialty Food Association. Let's hear what she has to say about it. Hi, I'm Jerry James Stone, and I'm here at the Summer Fancy Food Show. We're here with the Sophie Booth behind us. This is Brittany Pritchard. She is the marketing, what's your title again? Product everything. marketing Product director. marketing, just everything. Like, tell us about the Sophie, the Sophie Winners behind us. Yeah, so we're here at the Sophie Winners Showcase, and when you win a Sophie, we've been told that some of the winners have gotten up to 600% increase in their sales. So winning a Sophie is huge for a brand, and we're so excited to really help them in our industry. And the cool thing about it is I'm gonna take some of this stuff and I'm gonna make some really great recipes with it. So stay tuned. Let's do it. So isn't that cool? Pretty cool, right? But let me show you how to make this cocktail because that's what you're here for. Okay, so to make this delicious cocktail, we're gonna start off with some fresh cilantro. Add just a little bit of our tequila. Sugar. Add a pinch of salt. And now we're just gonna muddle that. So I want to know, have you had a Paloma before or have you even heard of it? If not, that's okay. Let me know though. I want to know if you've heard of a Paloma and if you have, cool. If you haven't, also maybe tell me some of your other favorite cocktails. I want to know those too. We're going to add in a little bit of fresh lime juice. Add the remaining tequila. Add in some crushed ice. and our shrub. Mix that together. Now we're gonna strain it and serve it. Okay, so maybe you're wondering why I'm stirring this cocktail. Have you ever wondered why some cocktails are shaken and some are stirred? Well, there's no real hard, fast rule. In fact, every bartender kind of does their own thing, to be honest, but here's my rules. So when it comes to shaking a cocktail, typically I shake cocktails that have fruit juices or dairy like milk or eggs in them or cream liqueurs. Those are typically things that I shake. I stir it if it's just distilled liquors because I don't wanna overwork those. In this particular case, while it does have fresh citrus in it, the shrub actually has uh, sparkling water. So you never wanna shake something that's carbonated on any level. So that's why I'm stirring. So I'm gonna fill a Collins glass about two thirds of the way full with crushed ice and cubed watermelon. The cool thing about making handmade cocktails is just you get to explore all these different types of ingredients. I would love to know what are some of your favorite cocktail ingredients and know the booze doesn't count. And just pour in our cocktail. Now the shrub is a honeydew shrub and it's really has a nice neutral flavor to it when it comes to the melon flavor. So you could use cantaloupe. I'm using watermelon really just for like the, the visual. Um, obviously you could use honeydew too. And give it a stir. And top it off with a fresh sprig of cilantro. How great does that look? Drinking time. So that's all there is to making this cocktail. Like I said, I'm using the shrub, this element shrub that's uh, honeydew and jalapeno. I used watermelon because I just wanted a little bit more sugar and I found better watermelons in the store than I did honeydew, but you can use whatever melon that you want. It's a really easy cocktail. I think that you're gonna love it. Check out Element Shrub if you haven't already. If you like this video, hey, give me a thumbs up. And if you like to cook or you like to drink, please subscribe. I release new videos every single week. And if there's something that you wanna see, drop a comment down below. I'll see you guys next time.